staying in Nigeria, the Supreme Court has upheld President Bola Tinubu's election win. The Abuja-based court's judgment ends an eight-month-long legal battle and gives Tinubu a clear mandate to govern Africa's most populous nation. Tinubu's rivals, Peter Obi and Atiku Abubakar, had claimed that the president's victory in February was marred by irregularities, including fraud and electoral law violations. The Election Commission acknowledged there were glitches in the voting system, but denied that the election's integrity had been compromised. Tinubu was sworn in May, becoming Nigeria's 16th president. His tenure comes at a time when Nigeria is grappling with significant nation-building problems, including double-digit inflation, foreign currency shortages, and widespread insecurity. On the whole, having resolved all the issues against the appellants, it is my view that, is no, that there is no merit in this appeal, and it is hereby dismissed. The judgment of the court below, delivered on the 6th of September 2023, affirming the election of the second respondent as the duly elected president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, is thereby affirmed. The judgment was sound. Um, we invite all political parties um, to join hands with Mr. President um, so that we can move this country forward together. Many oppositions have risen against Nubu and they have come up with nothing or less. And at the end, we can see that Nubu has actually, he has, he has battled and won. So I can tell you that the judiciary, they are right on their own terms and parts. It doesn't change anything. People are suffering. People are going through a hard time. And the situation is uh, very critical. Whether it's there, whether it's not. The bottom line is that um, they should fix the country. But the way they are going, I don't think uh, they have an agenda for the country. 